Hello and welcome to my tutorial for Game Booster. This is also a kind of like tutorial on how to make your games run faster and um, a lot smoother pretty much uh, using Game Booster. Uh, so um, just before I start out you need to download Game Booster. I'll put a link in the description underneath the video. And um, this is freeware so uh, you don't need to pay for it. If you ever find a website saying you need to pay for it or something then um, don't because you don't have to. So uh, once you've downloaded it, installed it, I'm not going to show you how to do that either, it's quite easy. Um, you should get these two icons, one says switch to game mode, the other says game booster. You want to start up game booster, and click yes. Sorry if you hear some noise, my microphone is kind of like balancing because it's broke. So uh, once you start up, you get this. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry about that. And um, all you want to do is check these by here. And what these are is uh, the programs which Game Booster will temporarily shut down while you're playing a game. And make sure this unnecessary services box is ticked. Uh, that just ticks all these boxes. And I'll have a browse through them and make sure there is nothing that you want to keep. For example, say Windows Search. If doing a game, I often went let's search for some shit then um, you want to go and untick that box but uh, obviously I'm not going to be bloody searching for something while I'm running like a game am I? You know, that's just not something you do so make sure that box is checked ticked. and then you get all these like uh, windows font and why would you need that while playing the game so once you've done that and had a quick browse through, um, you want to click switch to gaming mode and just wait for it to work and uh, if something's gone wrong you just click the report button, pretty simple. As you can see it's stopping all the services and then it cleans and defrags your RAM. So uh, that massively increases it and then it minimizes it to the tree. Now I'm going to show you how to um, start turn it back to the normal mode so you can use all these features so all you click is back to normal mode and it should do the same now demon tools is trying to put in no get away and you just wait and wait and wait and there we go um it's back to normal mode, I can use the browsing and everything now and um, that's basically it, I would like to just say that if you're too lazy to start it up and click switch the gaming mode you can just start up switch the gaming mode and also this tool really um, helps a lot for example I'm, I was playing Minecraft on my laptop before and it was a bit laggy so I installed this and um, it got rid of most of the lag, not all of it uh, but a great chunk of it. So if you're having problems, I recommend this software over anything else. Thanks for watching my video. Uh, please rate, comment, and subscribe.